Hello there. Welcome back to the second episode of the Gankam series. If you missed the first one, you can find the link in the description below. I hope you enjoyed learning about Jaru, Andola, and Datu Gamakams in the first video. And by the end of this series, you will be familiar with the common types of Gamakams used in Indian music. So let's get started. Just like the last episode, we will be listening to the song P.U. Bole from the movie Parinita to observe and learn more about Gamakams. Let's listen to another segment of the song now and come back to analyze the Gamakams in it. एक नदी से मैंने पूछा इथला के चल दी कहा सो नाउ लेट्स डीकोड द स्वरम्स फॉर द लाइन एक नदी से मैंने पूछा इथला के चल दी कहा वेरी सिंपली इट वुड बी स प द प स प द प स प म प द प बट इट एक्चुअली इज so here you notice that sa pa da pa is actually sa pa da da pa pa so the da is da da and a keen observer will realize that we are stressing the second da 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 pa pa this is also a type of gamakam and it's called spuritam this has you know this is where two identical notes and we give an upward push to the second note from the previous identical note raga lab students will realize that when while teaching janta swarams we tell them to emphasize the second note when a note is repeated many a times it's used to lend more weight or feel to the lyrics of the song and our next gamakam is also widely used in all types of indian music it is called the kampitam this is a gamakam in which a note oscillates between itself and the next higher or the next lower note you know for example here when the line ends at chaldi kaha the word kaha ends on the note pa so instead of holding it still chaldi kaha we oscillate the pa so it is chaldi kaha so pa da pa da pa da pa this is an example of kampita gamakam and i'm pretty sure you would have heard this in many many other songs as well So now you know five prominent gamakams in Carnatic music and next time you listen to a song try to identify these gamakams or let us know in the comments below where else or what other examples you have for spuritam kampitam or the other three gamakams that we taught you Listen to this song again and try to find any other gamakams if you have not covered yet and let's see if you can leave us a comment about those as well Gamakams are present in western music too here they are called uh, ornamentations in general and there's various subtypes We shall look into that comparison as well once we learn all the 15 gamakam styles in Carnatic music. You already know 5 now, 10 more to come. So keep watching the space for the next episode that will cover those gamakams. You can also register for a Raga Labs course at the links given below and one of our expert teachers will coach you on how to sing gamakams effectively in both classical and film music. Hope you enjoyed this session or this video in our gamakam series and see you again very soon in the next one